law that we're no longer under is this law. We're no longer required to sacrifice animals. We're no longer required to, 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 to be circumcised. And God says, look, look, it's not that now. Jesus has come. He's died for your sins. Now, if you love me, keep my commandments. It's right there in the blueprint. You know what's amazing? Here's what amazes me. That you can look at that blueprint and you can see, yeah, we're supposed to accept Christ's sacrifice, right? Altar sacrifice, right? And, and yeah, we're supposed to be baptized. Amen. And, and yeah, we're supposed to study God's word. Tebra showbread. Amen. And yeah, we're supposed to let our light shine. A, a, a seven branch candlestick. Amen. And yeah, we're supposed to pray. Yes, yes, yes. Amen. But when it comes to the throne of God and the law that is found there, suddenly... Uh, Satan rebel against in heaven. The law of God. Remember, his argument was, I don't need a law in order to be holy like God. I can be like God on my own terms. 